What's up, guys? All right, so I'm doing our ritual miracles, like I did on my last video, and now we're doing Fafnir. So Fafnir was tough for a while, and truthfully, until I got these two legendaries, he was just hard. So <laughs> hopefully, for this, <laughs> you know, for anyone watching this video, you have at least Ahmed you know, or at least Meredith. You need Meredith. If you don't have any of these legendaries and you want to at least get some Fafnir wins, you need Meredith. She's so great. The fact that she can dispel a buff, heal everyone, provide speed, it's just amazing. Also, this girl is also Lu Guang. She can steal Fafnir's buff that gives him crit damage. And of course, providing uh, multi-attacks. So like all of this is great. Now the thing and Gab's great because she's defense break and multi hits. You know anything to whittle down that shield that you're probably having a problem with. Now what makes us fast and efficient is him, <laughs> Ying Chuan. If you're lucky enough to have him, then you're gonna you're gonna know immediately why this battle becomes easier just having him. His passive is he puts like some type of debuff on you i forgot it's called like eyes or something and anytime someone else attacks that enemy so the boss he can attack immediately after it's his skill one but that's still annoying every single time he's awesome like especially for this or just multi-hits like uh temporal tower boss uh, level 50 perfect for he just attacks after everyone. And the stack applies to bosses. Except for Desolate Lands. Which I guess would be cheap. Although it should be. <laughs> As you see him constantly attacking after everyone attacking. Ahmed. The reason why he's there is one. He multi-hits and he gets rid of that disease. I'm, I'm sorry. The anti-HP thing. It's not disease. It's something else. I forgot what it's called. But basically, you can't heal it. So we're just going to watch as these turns go on. So if you see here, you'll see the buff that uh, uh, Fafnir has. It basically gives you crit damage. Defense breaks. Third eye seal. That's what it's called. So this is the annoying part. As you see, he doesn't have any health being blocked. That's what Ahmed's good for. So she didn't steal it. But it's still there, but it's probably because the shield's up. So we want these multi-hits. We might not get it. Three more. Each one dead? Nice, still alive. Nice. All right, cool. So Ahmed's going to heal him back up. So as long as we have that third eye on him. See, look, full healed. That's great. Still haven't stole that buff. Let's see. Is it on her? Oh, yeah, it is on her. Okay, so you could just steal individual three of them. So let's look. So, and Varl's shard. Crit damage, 30% per stack, which is crazy. So like, she provides a lot of benefit. If you can get that stack on her, she just slaps Fafnir slowly. <laughs> After you get rid of the shield, of course. Man, I'm just not getting rid of the shield right now. I'm just tanking these hits. That's why it's good to have Ahmed, because he just heals you right up. Uh, got the AP up. Third eye still going. Is Gab dead? No, she's not. Holding on by her dear life. We have Meredith as the backup healer. So that's good. Uh, seven. We need... Oh yeah, I also have her own Astral. So she can just keep going. We got two stacks of that R and Lard. <laughs> uh, crit damage on Li Guang. And of course, you know the shield never used to be that much, but the skill 3 for Gab is 3, that's 4, skill 3 for Lee Gwaine. Uh That's nothing because you're healing someone, again a double hit, and then 4 hits for Ahmed to get rid of that shield. So that's good. Because I don't know if you know, if someone actually dies, he just gets stronger. That's a running theme for all of the... Uh, ritual miracle bosses. That's it. 
of course, I'm going to show you a, a blitz after this to show you how effective it is. It's about 90%, I want to say. Cool. We'll do a blitz. We'll make sure everything sells. Just flawless. Nice. Let's do max so you guys can see. And yeah, that's it. And I hope you guys enjoy. We can watch the other... The next video is going to be on APEP. Now, APEP is tricky. I fail on APEP a lot. But I can provide you with kind of a chance. <laughs> and yeah, 100%. Cool. 90% actually. I fail sometimes. Alright guys, see you later.